We have had students accepted to Georgetown, Baylor, Tulane, NYU, George Washington, Ohio, Pennsylvania, Maryland, Massachusetts, Florida. The overall picture of advising to medical dental school is a job that starts when you're a freshman and goes until you're a senior or beyond. A lot of students have in their mind that I'll attend medical school one day and I'll get there one day and then junior year creeps up and you realize that you've got all these classes that you need to take and you need to be studying for the MCAT and you need however many volunteering hours and research hours. But getting involved with the Health Professions Advising Program from the beginning can really save you a lot of stress in the end. Karen has really helped me with deciding what classes I need to take and what sort of a timeline I need to have certain classes by and the expectations that the mission boards have in terms of volunteer hours, shadowing hours. My experiences with Karen Iper and the Health Professions Advising Program have been incredibly important to my success as a pre-medical student. One day I just went up to her and said, hey, I think I want to go to medical school. Can I come talk to you? Our initial meeting was really just Karen getting to know me as a student and my interests and what I hoped for in the future. Karen's always accessible. She's, it's easy to approach her and just the connections that she helps you set up in your undergrad really develops over time. The Health Professions Advising Program has been very beneficial. It gave me insight on what to do to be a successful applicant to medical school. She really helped to guide me as my interests changed and as I developed as a student. She knows all the steps that you should take along the way. Last year we had 140 students accepted into all areas of healthcare: Allied Health, Nursing, Dental School, Pharmacy School, Medical School. We want our students to be qualified to go wherever they want to go. We want them to have options.